why Jesus cannot be God. And one of the reasons why Jesus cannot be God is he was given power and authority according to the New Testament. Uh, there are many verses that indicate that Jesus' power and authority were given to him by God the Father. If Jesus was the eternal God or co-equal with God, then he would have always had those things that the New Testament says he was given. So we read in the, uh, in the Gospels, that, uh, in the New Testament, that Jesus was given authority. Jesus was given a name above every, uh, above every name. He was given work to finish by the Father. Uh, Gospel of John, chapter 5, verse 36. Given those who believe in him by the Father. John 6, uh, 39. Given, a, given a, uh, glory. Uh, John, chapter 17, verse 22. And John, chapter 17, verse 24. Given his cup. His torture and uh, his torture and death by the uh, by God the Father in John chapter eighteen verse eleven, uh, seated at God's own right hand in Ephesians chapter one verse twenty one, appointed over the church. Ephesians chapter one verse twenty two. So notice how Jesus was given authority. He was given a name. He was given glory. He was given, uh, you know, uh, he was seated at God's right hand power. So the conclusion is that Jesus, uh, Jesus is not co-equal to God or has God's power as he was given power and authority. He didn't always have it. Thus, Jesus is not God or co-equal to God as he was given, uh, you know, power, authority, and glory, uh, et cetera, et cetera. He didn't always have these things. So Jesus is, uh, co Jesus is dependent on God. Therefore, Jesus is not co-equal.